All right, class, please quiet down. Quiet down, class. Now, as you all know, today is our sexual education lesson. So if you could all please pay a lot of respect, that would be greatly appreciated. Aww. Great. Now, anyway, so uh, I actually have opted out of teaching this class um, since uh, I do hate to admit it, but I'm pretty inexperienced. I am actually a virgin. <laughs> <laughs> Funny. Well, uh, yeah, at least I admit it um, is the thing. So anyway, I have brought along someone with uh, much more experience than me, uh, and by that I mean some experience at all, and that is my stepdad, Ned. Oi, oi, how are we feeling? Oh, come on, you guys can do better than that. I said, how are we feeling? Horny. That's the way. Okay, so... Uh, why am I here? I'm here to talk to you a lot about sexual health. So we're all starting to get to that age, okay, where we're starting to get titties and we're starting to develop a love for titties. Now, I remember my first love for titties. It was Lynette Swanston in year one and she had a big old set of cannons and I remember seeing that set and thinking, yep, nice. So believe me, I know how you feel. All right, I know that you guys are all full steam ahead towards puberty and things are starting to happen to you that you might not know how to explain. Like all the fellas in the room, I'm sure that you're experiencing morning erections, waking up with an erection. Okay, now let's go around the room and we'll all say our favorite nicknames for an erection because I know we've all got our own. Stiffy. Stiffy, nice, classic. Any more? Big hard rod. Big hard rod. Yep, nice. More? Big old fuck stick. Ooh, language, but yep, nice one. Big old stiff mammoth cock destructor pole. Okay, yep, this is getting weird. Let's move on. But uh, as we can see, there's many different nicknames and sexual innuendos for uh, a, a male's erection. Now, can anyone tell me what females have instead of an erection? A clunge? Uh, uh, so women have a, a vagina. Oh, okay, settle down. Okay, just, can anyone tell me how a baby's made? Anal. Uh, no, no, no. It's, it's... Gang bangs. Uh, no, guys. Okay, so babies are made from sexual intercourse, which is when a man inserts his erect penis into a girl's clunge. Vagina. Uh, sorry, uh, vagina. Uh, okay, so this is pretty unsafe. Even though it sounds fun... It's very dangerous, so boys need to use a thing called a condom to ensure both parties' safety. Now, I'm going to demonstrate to you how to put a condom on with this very, very above average banana. Now, show of hands before we do, who here's had sex before? Wow, uh, wow. Uh, that's, a, that's a lot. Uh, uh, yes. Oh, my girlfriend is allergic to latex and she doesn't have a gag reflex, so I can't use a condom. Well, in that case, you should, um... Sir, do you, do you watch Mia Khalifa? Oh, of course. Uh, no. <laughs> what? Who's that? Sir, is it bad that I went to a sex party with 38 other people and not one of them used protection? And also, I don't remember a lot of it. Holy fucking shit. Um... Uh, what? What? Matt, are you a virgin? No! <laughs> what? No? I have sex... All, all, the all the time. Oh my god! <laughs> Ned's a virgin! <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> no, I'm not! I'm not a virgin! I had sex this morning! I, s s I have sex women <laughs> all the time! Ned's a virgin! Ned's a virgin! Ned's a virgin! Ned's a virgin! No, I'm not! Ned's a Stop virgin. saying that! I'm not Ned's a virgin! 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 Ned's a virgin. Ned's a virgin. Ned's a virgin.